Mac Pro here. Um, you can see the back with the ports on it. Uh, it six Thunderbolt 2 ports, four USB 3.0, uh, Ethernet, and the other various paraphernalia. Um, you've got light up uh, emblems on here, which will sense when you're moving the device and uh, light up for you to uh, kind of easily find your ports there. Uh, we'll spin it around so you can see the front of it. And the uh, new Mac Pro is uh, going to ship in December. That was just announced. Uh, it starts at $29.99 uh, $29 for the 3.7 gigahertz quad core Xeon, 12 gigabytes of DRAM, 2 gigabytes of video RAM, and 256 gigabyte SSD. Uh, about 70% less energy consumption here than the original Mac Pro. Uh, they also announced uh, once again, uh, reiterated that it will be assembled in the U.S. Um, they've got uh, AMD Fire Pro graphics, dual Fire Pro graphics, one terabyte of flash storage, uh, up to 4K uh, HDMI video out, and it's uh, tuned for Final Cut Pro 10 and Aperture, of course, uh, Apple's devices. Uh, so the Mac Pro itself is very warm to the touch. Uh, the vent on top uh, kind of uh, emanates uh, air that's enough to kind of warm your hands up if you're a little chilly, uh, which is nice. Uh, you've got uh, very smooth finish. Uh, all the venting is through the top, the air intake is through the bottom here, uh, and it's fairly light. It's about uh, about the weight of uh, kind of an overloaded lunchbox. Uh, and that's the new Mac Pro, which will be available in December.